Let's create a new account on Windows 11. On your Start button, right-click and go to Settings. On the left-hand side, you want to click on Accounts. And then you want to click on Family and Other Users on the right-hand side. In the middle here, we can click on Add Account. And at this point, it's asking for a Microsoft account information. We are going to create a local account. So we are going to say here, I don't have this person's sign-in information. Right? And again, Microsoft wants to have their account uh, style hooked in. But we're not looking for that at the moment. We want a local account. So we are going to click on Add a User without a Microsoft account. Right now, we can give the username. So in this case, I'm just going to put owner. You can enter a password or not, as you see fit, depending on your security situation. And we can click Next. Now we have this new account. If we click on the arrow to the right, we have account options and we can change account type. So if we click on there, we're going to find out that owner is a standard user. A standard user can't uh, install applications and do other things. So we're going to click on the little down arrow there and switch that to administrator. Give that account full control over the computer. Of course, if you're setting up a, an account for a child or for an employee, you may want to keep it standard. We're going to click OK. And now owner is an administrator. If you need to remove the, the account in the future, you can go back in this area and click on remove. We can close that. And now uh, when you log out and go to log back in, you'll have the owner option as an account to sign into.